Hello, my name is Richmond and welcome to my channel. My priority is to help you digitize and digitize well in Embed. Let's get started. Today's tutorial is on how to crop your images. This tutorial will be very similar to the previous tutorial I taught. That is how to import images to your workspace. It's very similar to the second method. So please take notes as I teach, as I go through the process. So you have to import your image and click on no. Let's you 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 want your finished logo to be in three inches so you take your rule and you measure it and it's 1.5 inches so you have to crop your image to be to get the logo very precise or to close to closer to three inches so you click on crop you go to image then you click on crop You will adjust the rectangle. Yeah. After readjusting it to match the size of your logo, you don't have to, you, you wouldn't want to get it very closer to this, to the logo. You just don't want to because when it's very closer and you are digitizing around it, you won't get enough space to see. To, to make your digitizing here. There is no enough space there. When you are, very, you are cropping your image, you should keep it a little bit afar from the image. Then right click on it, then you, you right click on it. Then you right click on your workspace, then you click on crop image. So you go here, and you go to you go to image you go to edit image window you go to the second tab then you increase your logo <clears throat> you increase the height of your logo because that is the highest uh, length in the logo so you increase it to i think three three inches to Click on OK and click on Apply. Okay, then you measure your logo. You see three inches. Then you can reduce it a little bit. Yeah. Okay, around eight five or eight four. Measure your logo. At least it's a little bit closer to three inches. So after digitizing, when you reduce it to three inches, it won't really affect your design. Now we have another advanced method in cropping your image. Now the, let me teach you the advanced method in cropping your image too. You click on import, go to image, you click on import, click on open. And here, you won't go to crop, you go to edit image window. Can you see the borders around these sections? You can drag these borders closer to the image just as we did. After, after bringing it closer to your image, then you click on apply to crop it. See, this is very simple. It's, I, will, I, will, I will say it's an advanced method of cropping your image. And afterwards, you go to the second tab as we did, and you, you increase the size of your image depending on how you want your logo after you digitize it. Hello, this is Richmond, helping you digitize and embed. Subscribe to my channel for more future content like this. Thank you. Bye-bye. See you next time.